Join me as I take on the challenge of making food look smoky without using any fire. Let's see if I can pull it off. Making food look good is just as important as making it taste good. And one of the coolest effects you can achieve is that smoky look. There's something about the depth and richness it adds to a dish that really makes it pop visually. Achieving that smoky appearance can be tricky, especially if you're working in a kitchen without a smoker or grill. A lot of people think the only way to get that look is by using actual smoke or fire, but that's not always practical or safe. I've definitely been there, trying to get that perfect smoky photo for a recipe, but ending up with a kitchen full of smoke instead. And then there's the issue of flavor. Sometimes you want that smoky taste, but not always. Another challenge is that smoky look can be really fleeting. It might look great in a photo, but it doesn't always translate to video or even to a plate. So you need techniques that are reliable and easy to execute. The thing is, there are some really clever techniques and tools out there that can help you achieve that smoky look without the hassle. From specific ingredients to styling tricks, there are plenty of ways to get creative. One technique that I love is using smoked paprika or liquid smoke to give food that authentic smoky flavor and color. These ingredients can be used in everything from sauces to marinades, and they add an incredible depth to dishes. Another technique is to use a blowtorch to add a bit of char to the food. This can be especially effective for vegetables or meats. Food styling also plays a huge role in achieving that smoky look. The way you arrange the food, the lighting, and even the background can all contribute to that smoky effect. For example, using a dark background can really make the food stand out and give it a smoky appearance. If you want to take it to the next level, you can try using a smoke gun. These are handheld devices that produce a stream of smoke, which you can use to add a smoky effect to your food. They're really easy to use and can add a professional touch to your dishes. The most effective method I've found, though, is using a combination of ingredients and styling techniques. For example, you can use a mixture of smoked paprika and olive oil to give food a smoky sheen, and then style it in a way that accentuates that effect. So, to recap, we've covered some really simple and effective techniques for making food look smoky without using any fire. Whether you're a food stylist, a photographer, or just someone who loves cooking, these techniques can really elevate your dishes. Give these techniques a try at home and share your results in the comments below. I'd love to see what you're working on.